so much, Alia. Uh, you look wonderful. Let's start with that, of course. And let's ask you why you're here. You know, we often see you play so many roles on screen, and we know that you don many hats off screen as well. Um, can I just, you know, take a minute and do a little bit of tarry because I'm not. Yes. Please don't. No, she says. No, no, don't. Okay, we'll start. You can tell me in my year later. How about global icon? I mean, no, no, it has to be. I'm going to walk off stage. Actor par excellence. Producer, entrepreneur, and now of course. Okay, how about this one? Executive producer for Culture. That's fine, right? With your production company, Eternal Sunshine Productions. So it would be great for us to know, you know, how did this come into being and what made you come on board as executive producer? <coughs> so good afternoon, everyone. Thank you for being here today. Um, so fun story, which I've never said before. Uh, Richie and I met back in 2022. I was uh, full grown pregnant, um, just about to pop. Yeah, very close to popping. Uh, we spoke about everything under the sun. We spoke about you know, parenting, we spoke about just cinema, movies, art. Um, and in that meeting, he took me through the world of poacher. I mean, firstly, I was flabbergasted that it was all based on true events. Um, and then we kept talking. You know, he was gracious enough to share uh, the first two episodes. Um, I then watched the whole show. But I have to say, forget executive producer, I just responded as a person. When I saw the show, A, I couldn't stop watching it. Like, it was, it's a binge and how. Um, you don't, you can't take your eyes off the screen. You can't take your, you know, take yourself away from these characters. Um, Nimisha is not here today, but I mean, she's outstanding. Roshan, who I had the honor of working with, is unbelievable. And Divya and Sir, and, and, and not just the three of them, the whole cast, they really, really hold, you know, they hold your attention to the screen. And of course, Richie has told this story so beautifully. Um, it just really moved me. It moved me emotionally, it moved me physically towards him saying, <laughs> Tell me what I can do and how can I help. Um, and at Eternal, um, Eternal being me and my partner slash sister Shahi Bhatt and our business head Prishma, we are a tiny team of three. But we really believe that we would like to be a part of stories that move you and impact you and stir some sort of conversation long after you've seen what you've seen. So whether it's a conversation with yourself, whether it's a conversation with another person. Like I remember sitting Richie down and asking him multiple questions. I think we went through a whole interrogation with you, right? That's right after we watched it. You just want to know more and I'm not going to say too much because I think this is just the beginning of the journey. Um, and I say that because I genuinely believe it's just the beginning. So without further ado, I think let's bring the world of poacher to the people and I, I, I have to say this, I can write it down right now that your minds are going to be blown. So please, let's go ahead. Well, thank you so much, Alia. We're going to take a look at the... Why? What are that? Blue, blue. Center. 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 Could you get the lights on to be slightly brighter, please? At the sound console. Thank you. 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 Thank Well, thank you so much. And uh, while, of course, the stage gets set for a very interesting QA, I'm going to request you to step one step forward for me. Nali, I'm going to give you back that mic because you might be the most seasoned person to answer this question. Every time there's a trailer launch, where I'm part of First time I'm not in the trailer. Exactly. Um, but I, it's still, there is, there is still butterflies and elephants and tigers and monkeys all around us, inside us, because um, I think when you're creatively connected and you want something to do really well, there is anticipation and there's nerves. And um, I have to say, it, it, it feels very relaxing to not be in the trailer, but it's still uh, very exciting. Um, because 
look at the trailer. You know, it's so exciting. I can't wait for people to see more and you know see the show on the 23rd of Feb. Um, and then we'll talk more. Fantastic. And in that, of course, magically the chairs have appeared right behind us. Please take a seat, ladies and gentlemen, while we sit down for a QA. By the model on real life wildlife fighters, how did you maintain the balance of fact and fiction while crafting the story? Yeah, because inspired by true events, is, you know, it can be extremely tricky. Yes. Um, so, I mean, look, the, the, as Manish mentioned before, the research process is the research process is very elaborate, and that's for anything that the audience will experience while watching this, the eight episodes. I experienced over two years while I was researching it. Um, so it was a slow burn for me and a slow realization. And as I gather all of that information, I literally just take the moments that I responded so viscerally to as a human being, and I, and I channel that into the series, basically. So obviously I've curated what to do and what, what, not, what to use and what not to use. This is a fictionalized dramatization of true events. Um, it's inspired by the biggest South Dakota case in Indian history. Many characters are amalgamations and some of them are direct. Um, I will say generally I, I will do character extrapolations in backgrounds of characters, personal stories, um, which are based on educated guesses. And I try not to veer away from the criminal aspect because I cannot, there's a lot of strange things in poetry you'll see, yes? Um, and you know, a moment for Amazon here, just because, you know, they are such a fan fabulous platform, they give that reach uh, to a show like Pocha. Um, from the very beginning, the first time we all got on to a marketing call, the feeling was, yaar, just go genuine, just go real. The show will do its talking. It's not marketing karne ki zarurat nahi aise. Just let the content do the talking and it's doing it. Um, I think you just call me like I can be this green mascot for you all right now uh, to just say this louder and louder but Pocho releases is out in the world on the 23rd of Feb and um, the vision is out there for the world to see. Thank you. Thank you so much for adding your weight, your voice and your love to that. That brings me to Manish. Hi Manish, how are you doing? Well, I want to ask you when Richie first came to you with Pocho, you kind of briefly mentioned in the start, you know, but let's go to that. How did you actually get associated? So before I get to the... Perfect. Um, everybody was aware at that time. When I watched it, I was perhaps not aware, but it still deeply impacted me. Um, and I don't think um, I say this, I'm, I'm not saying this just because I'm here sitting on the stage, but it really, really leaves an impact. And you really think about it. And I was in tears, and I was smiling, and I was entertained, and I was scared, and I was thr thrilled, and I was, you know, all the things put together. Uh, but supporting a story like this, I think for us as an audience is really important. But I think I really want to thank Rishi for bringing us this story and for putting us putting, putting this together. Just the way you caught on to that one moment when it was sent to you while you were doing something else for Google and this came to you and, and you said, okay, no, this is something that I'm going to come back and I'm going to tell this story. I think um, there's a lot of genuineness in it, there's a lot of heart in it and that really comes across when you see the show. Thank you so much for your question and thank you for that answer. Our next question will be... But what is that one thing that drew you most towards the project? What drew you most towards the project? The one thing... <laughs> it's, I, it's really hard to say genuinely and I'm not just being like cute with my answer because there is so much. Um, for starters, the performances uh, which I spoke a little bit about um, but Nimisha, Roshan and Devendu sir are just fantastic. I mean, forever fans. Uh, I'm, I'm forever a fan of all of them. Uh, because what they brought to their characters, they have... It's about the overarching, of course, crime that is going through the show. And that's, the, you know, that's just taking all, you through all the eight episodes. But you're also going deeper into their life, which is so enriching, so interesting, so emotional. There are beautiful moments that each of the characters have, which I can right now think, oh, I'm not going to say it because it'll be giving too many moments away. Like, there's this one scene, I won't give, I won't say too much, okay? But there's this one scene that Roshan has, can I say with his son? 
Okay, yeah, with his son, yeah, which yeah, is beautiful. Right. Now you watch it, you know what I mean. There's this one shot that Nimsha gives at the end, which I was like really shaking. And there's this one scene that Divyendu Sir Sir has with his, can I say niece? Yeah, with his niece, which is again so beautiful. Now these are one one scenes, but I'm just bringing up, bring it up because I knew, I know for a fact, like when my sister and I exchange notes, those were the scenes that really, you know, uh, propped us uh, out to us. The way you see in the end of the trailer, for example, how you saw each and every animal, that's something when I, every time I see the trailer, um, I, I get goosebumps. Every time you see an animal in the show, there's, by the way, purely visual effects. Um, it, you just, you're so enamored. The perspective with which Richie has told the story, the narrative, you really feel like the other in the story. Um, and just, just the beats, just the drama, just the everything. So yeah, just not one thing, there are too many things. Um, now I'm, I'm going to stop talking, just watch the show. Thank you, thank you, Shravan, for that question. Look, how many lights are you? Let's work in the light. Left, left, please. Left, please. Are you left? Are you left? Are you left? Now start from your left side. Left, please. Now your left side. Left, left, please. Ali, left, 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 please. Left, left. Ali, left side. Left, left. Left, please. Ali, left side. Solo. Now Ali, solo. Ali, follow. Ali, left side, left side. Ali, 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 left side